welcome back to the Davis Manor. I'm Brittany and today I thought I would just take you along. It's finally the weekend. Um, we're grilling and then I have a lot of things planned for the weekend. Um, I want to do some painting. I want to go Halloween hunting. I want to do some decorating. So I figured I'd just bring you guys along with me. It's really hard for me to focus on decorating when I have a thousand projects I want to get done. Like I want to paint my bedroom. I need to get the wallpaper off. Um, I want to paint our bathroom. So many things I want to get done before I can like fully decorate. Is anybody else like that? Anyway, it's beautiful out. It's like 78 degrees. And it's just, it felt a lot cooler earlier, but it still feels pretty good right now. So yeah, I guess this is gonna be another day in the life type vlog, cause I don't even know what I'm doing yet. So just stay tuned and we'll see what we get. <laughs> we'll see what we get into. I have a spooky beverage of the day today, actually. Rogue Bat Squatch. So hazy IPA. And it's actually really good. Six. 6.7% alcohol. I'm really getting into IPAs lately. I don't know why. I never used to like them. I'm just glad it's the weekend. <laughs> and, and here's his tattoo. No, I don't want that. Alright, we'll stop talking. And here's his tattoo. Hey everyone, we are on our way to the thrift store. We're going to the same thrift store that we went um, a couple weeks ago where we got this and a couple other goodies. And today I've got Drew with me. He's tagging along for the adventure today. So, all right, well, let's see what we can find. And also, um, we went to Home Goods today. We went to Big Lots and Dollar Tree yesterday and didn't really find any Halloween stuff yet. But we did find one thing I'll show you guys when we get home. Um, like I said, it's not Halloween, but it could be. Um, I don't want to give it away yet. I'll show you whenever we get back. <music> Mall or thrift, 
thrift store, thrift store, antique mall, whatever it is. Um, and we got some goodies. So I just wanted to show you what we got. First things first, if you saw my most recent reel, um, I've been putting up some antique photos in my dining room. So look at this. Can you see how massive this is? And like the frame is so beautiful and spooky. I nearly lost it when I saw this. I love the picture, but the frame is what sold me. How stinking cute is that? Okay, next. So also we went to Home Goods and I found the Stranger Things light says it's USB or battery operated. It was $25, which I thought was a little steep, but this was before we went to the thrift store and I thought, this is my first spooky-ish find. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> it's just like a little box. I'm trying to get out of the glare there. There we go. It's pretty cute. 25 bucks, like I said, is a little steep, but I really didn't think I was gonna find anything else. So I got it. Plus I think that'll look really cute in my office. Sometimes it feels like I'm in the upside down when I'm at work, so it fits. And sometimes things can't get stranger there. <laughs> it's fine. Speaking of stranger things, at the thrift mall, we also got these Stranger Things socks. See if you can see them okay. Yeah. That'd be perfect for season or the, I mean, there's some all over this. Just ignore all that gunk. Um, Perfect for like watching the last season. Have some like little Stranger Things snacks. Cuddle up with this, turn our little new light on. Okay, I don't know what is gonna be the best thing to show you like for last. Okay, I also got these little things. I guess it makes more sense to go this way. Welcome, Boo. How cute. They're just little wood signs. I thought they would look cute somewhere. They're only a dollar each. Couldn't pass up something like that. So that was also at the thrift mall. I guess everything else is at the thrift mall besides the Stranger Things. Okay. We are like currently obsessed with this movie. Halloween 3, Season of the Witch. We're obsessed. Look how stinking cute this is. And it's like heavy duty, hard mask. I don't, I don't know what we're gonna be doing with this yet. If we're just gonna keep it in the packaging or we might put it on our skeletons sitting around our dining room table um, because two of them so far have masks. Two of them need masks and then one of them's got like a pumpkin head. So. We've got this and we have one more mask, which I'll show you. I think I'm gonna show you that last because it's my favorite thing. But we've got this up next. Oh, look at this. I looked it up online. I'm pretty sure this is from 96. I mean, I could be wrong because this right here says it's 84, 85, but that could have just been when the movie was released because when I looked up this bust, you like hang it on the wall. When I looked it up, it said 96. So I don't know, I'm not really sure yet, but it's kind of, it's not like super heavy duty. I mean, it's, it's solid. I mean, well, it's hollow, but it's a nice piece. It's not like you can't like squeeze it, um, but it's not super heavy. I don't even know how to explain this, but I figured hanging it up on the wall isn't gonna take anything. It's not gonna fall, it's not gonna break, it's not gonna shatter. This is perfect for like a spooky hallway, which I don't even know where this is going yet, but we saw it, we had to have it. Yep, 
He is so creepy. All right, last but definitely not least. I saw this and I immediately was like, that's going home with me. <laughs> Look at this Goosebumps mask. Oh. oh my gosh, who else was obsessed with not just Goosebumps in general, but the haunted mask? Who was obsessed? Because Carly Beth and me would have been best friends. That's all I'm saying. Oh my gosh. I'm so pumped for this. And I think, like I said, my masks are going to go... I'm debating on this one because I kind of want to put this one up in a safe place. But it would look so cool having it on my skeleton at my dining room table. Let me know in the comments. Does this need to go up in a safe space? Or can my skeleton wear this year round? What do you think? He thinks he wants to get on the skeleton, but I don't know if that's the best choice for you. How stinking cool is this guy? I'm afraid to put it on because we've all seen the movie or we've all seen the show. We know it's going to happen. So not, I got too much going on right now to be dealing with that. Okay. You can get stuck on my skeleton's head. <laughs> Okay, so I think I recently spoke, maybe like two weeks ago, that we hit 100 subscribers. I blinked my eyes and we are at 200 subscribers. So I'm pumped, I hope you're pumped too, because Halloween season is coming up. And um, I just wanted to say thank you for stopping on in. You're always welcome here at the Davis Manor. And there's plenty more coming. Um, life's been a little crazy. I'm sure it's crazy for everyone. I always want to say that, um, but trying to get some home projects done. My dog is sick still, but she's doing okay. Um, but I'm so pumped for Halloween and I'm so excited to be sharing all of that with you guys. So for 200 subscribers, I just wanted to say cheers to that. Today we are drinking Bat Squatch and IPA. And I just wanna say cheers and thank you all for being here. And um, again, you're always welcome here at the Davis Manor and yeah. If you haven't had this, it is delicious. The spooky beverage of the day. Bat Squatch. Oh yeah. Okay, so I just completed a spooky project in my living room as well. I'm going to um, clean it all up, get the lights ready, and then I'll show you guys on a reel or on the next video. Um, but I think that's going to be it for today's video. Um, again, let me know in the comments what we should do with that Goosebumps mask. The options are get it into a stand and display it somewhere or let one, one of my skeletons wear it at the dining room table. You heard my vote and you heard the mask's vote. <laughs> um, so just let me know that in the comments. And then, like I said, I will be posting this spooky project that's in my living room coming up real soon and yeah that'll be it for today and i'll see you guys next time